The overall goal of this experiment is to determine the five methyl cytosine levels during chondrocyte D differentiation. This method can help answer key questions in cell based cartilage defect treatment, such as autologous chondrocyte implantation. The main advantage of this technique is that it is a reliable, simple, and rapid method for detecting the general DNA methylation level to evaluate control side phenotype. The implication of this technology extends towards share up of autologous control site implantation because DNA methylation during control site de differentiation is a major obstacle for autologous control site implantation treatment for cartilage defect. Though this method can provide insight into DNA methylation levels in control site de differentiation, it can also be applied to other studies of diseases, such as osteoarthritis. We first had the idea for this method when we read the protocols in the references on a dot plot method. Facial demonstration of this method is critical as the dot plot steps are difficult to learn. Genomic DNA should be denatured and be thoroughly diluted then be supported on a positively charged nylon membrane. Demonstrating the procedures will be Zhao Fengjia, a graduate student from our lab. The articular cartilage tissues used in this study were isolated from the knee joints of donor patients.